I saved that. <laughs> I saved myself. What is up, Game Breakers, and welcome back to SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. Last time we died. So I'm getting that fixed. <laughs> oh, shit. <yeah. laughs> I was aiming for them. So, yeah, last time we were. We got halfway through. Halfway through Jellyfish Fields to fight King Jellyfish. I think we're halfway through. Um, but yeah, we died last time. <laughs> and that's where we ended it off. So now we're going to get through these caves. Uh, this time we'll try not to hit the jellyfish. We hit them. Okay, I'm going to we get them all this time with the crates. Can I? Okay, I can. Hmm, <clears throat> strange. It's not showing up with, um... Oh, you've got to be joking. <sighs> oh, it's good that it's all sort of, like, unlocked the way. I thought I'd have to do it all again. Just make that. Right. I'm going to test to see if this is... Right, I'm going to check to see if these are contact damage or if it's just the tops. Ouch. Not the contact damage. Right, so for you who want to play this, don't touch them regardless. No, I'm going to kill this jellyfish first before it fucks me over. I'm just going to dodge the... I'm just going to, like, miss them out. The, um, the tiki's there. I might not even need it. Oh, I love me some video games. No. Well, fuck you then. Oh, are you joking? I was right by a checkpoint last time. Oh. <laughs> Maybe I'm not good at video games. Maybe I'm pretty bad at them. <laughs> Either way, I'm still enjoying this. Ow. Luckily there's some undies here. It's a shame there's no none of that, um there's not really any sharp sounding explosion sound. I think that might be um, something they're needing to fix Ooh, up a bit. I like that little idea. Hey, what have you got to say? I can jump up on thorn. Okay. Let's get them first. Well, I think you can stack them. Yeah, this, this whole jellyfish fields is technically your tutorial level. Um, quite a good one. Nice one to start in. Have I got the... Okay, no, I can't. Oh, I can't get everything. Good thing I can double jump. Ow. I just have to cause abuse. Oh yeah. Now, this is another gimmick for Patrick. He's got the, the these ice cubes. And they freeze up goo for a set amount of time. I don't know if uh, if going forward like that um speeds you up. One thing that I, th yeah, I think that there is another um, special move for Patrick, where SpongeBob's got on, um, where SpongeBob's got the bubble moves, um, and I think of an all-round attack. Patrick doesn't just throw stuff; he gets the belly flop as well. But the the things with the belly flop is that it, it, its moves are a lot 
it attacks a lot further. Hence our little shockwave. Or does it? Oh no, it stuns it! It's not okay, right. I got that wrong. It stuns. Oh wait a minute. Ow! Stop it! That's right, you can pick them up. So it can stun enemies. That's my, that's my bad, I forgot all about that. You can stun enemies and then throw them. But now we're at the end of Jellyfish Caves. We're under the lakes. I think we're nearly at King Jellyfish, which is... I said something oh, a bit wrong last time. Oh. Squidward tells me you're looking for the King Jellyfish. Yes. Good thing, too. That monster has been stinging all my good customers in their poop decks. I hear that you can find him up top of Old Sport Mountain here. Go hook that beast, sailor. Oh boy, Mr. Krabs. I'll see what I can do. Hmm. Right, anyway, as I was saying... <laughs> oh! I forgot that you get to see another one here. <laughs> okay. I'll admit, I like that. Because that is actually all three characters, but instead of sand, it just shows an actual squirrel. <laughs> They're a bit different, though. The tartar sauce in, that I had on them was more of a square-looking jar. Not that it's a problem, it's just that... Oh, it shows you where it's attacked. Okay, that's helpful. Now that it shows you where, um, where it exactly is aiming. Now, I don't recall that ever happening. It was more of a crapshoot. That's helpful, I like that. That's much better. Is there a bus stop anywhere? To change back to SpongeBob. No. I think that over there you do need SpongeBob, but I'll double check. I don't you might need them. Well there's a lot of jellyfish now. I don't think SpongeBob's underwear fits quite right. Oh, Mrs. Puff. Hello, Patrick. I've got a job for oh, you to do. Oh, it is a Patrick one. Oh, boy. I found a golden spatula, but those robots out on the island stole it and threw it into the lake. If you can figure out how to get it back, you're welcome to it. Sure enough, Mrs. Puff. Okay, we'll do this one. So, um... I'm correct. It was all about this. This stun. Sure got carry a lot of stuff around. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Sweet. Throw you there, pick you up, and throw you into this one. And then I've got two more to go, and then I get all of them. Hey, my back feels better. <laughs> Oops. It's quite a useful um, thing, the shotgun belly flop. You can do it with a regular one, all right. Oh, there's no one. <laughs> Play as a whistle. Play as a whistle. Now, for whatever reason, I had a lot of trouble with that mission as a kid. Do not ask me why. I have no clue. Because it is actually a really simple mission. Where's the duplicator going? Huh. Oh, there's um, there's a bus stop. 
No, Patrick might have something to say, and I just realised I might pull one scotch there. You haven't been driving. Of course not, Mrs. Puff. I don't even have a license. Oh, good. Then it was just another bad dream. <laughs> uh, oh, Mrs. Puff and our driving anxieties. Right. Where was Mr. Krabs? Because I don't know if he has a certain mission for SpongeBob. What are you waiting for, boy? Go get that king jellyfish. Sir, yes, sir. Okay, no, he doesn't. So yeah, king jellyfish isn't too far away now. We should be able to get to him by the end of this episode. I'm hoping. Whoa, whoa! Where did I survive that? Um. It shines. Let me say no, I'm not risking that. <laughs> right, for some reason my controller doesn't like the sneaking. Although it's behaving. There is a way you can sort of exploit, I think. Is it exploit? Um, no, not exploit. That's not, that's not the word I'm looking for. You can mess, uh, not mess, uh, what's the fucking word I'm looking for? Um, either way, the bubble bowl, when you get, when you unlock that, or the bubble mess up. What you get after defeating the second big boss is um, can can destroy the those um, uh, those tikis with the big ears that hide whenever you get near them. Oh, Jesus Christ, these things are relentless today. Take that, you beast. Right. Oh, another one. And we are dead. What I do like is that it is using tartar sauce. Um, that's two that I need to bubble bowl. Thing is that they will either be. Let me just see what it's opening up anyway. Ah. Okay. So I'm guessing what I'm going to do is I'm having to bowl them out of the sky and you get maybe a sock. You get something, that's for sure. Um, is that to go back to the caves? No, it isn't. Oh, there you go, some caves. Like a spring breeze. Get that, move back quickly. And we should move them all up. I feel like a new some spot. more health. And then destroy these robots over here, yada yada. But yeah, it's like SpongeBob was like, was one of my favourite shows. I know that the quality has dropped a lot. It's gotten better, I've heard. Sort of. But mm, it does still have some iffy episodes. But um, I think it's going to go back to its... Uh, crap quality now that uh, Stephen Hillenburg uh, has passed away not like was it last year he passed away either way it's a shame he passed away because um, he did create a show that I truly loved like, Spongebob was one of my favourite shows and that's why you click the shinies <laughs> any moment you get <laughs> so you still have plenty when you um, as you're going on And we continue on. I need Patrick for that. I think you can climb up here with Patrick. Yeah, you can. Um, there seems to be a suck somewhere. Seems to be like it seems that they have quite um contact damage iframes. I don't know why.
Dude, hat. It's good that you can you can like knock robots into the others though. I wonder how I get the sock that's over there though. I mean, can I get? Oh, I'll get round to it anyway. But I've said it before. I'll say it again. This game looks beautiful since it's had the HD re uh, the HD uh, treatment. Could see. Oh, okay. I was not expecting it to bounce me that way, but yeah, that's so. Did he say every ten? He'll give me a spatula. Oops. If I can find a way to like get these to blow up all at once without crouching, I'll do it. This is a quick way to get the the, the shinies. Get that to fire first. Oh! I didn't realise that SpongeBob um runs in terror. Oh that's cool! Uh the tartar sauce has um lasting damage. Um, it sort of stays there for a bit, and it can still damage you if you stand on it. Which, I don't know how that works, I mean, I do, well then again, Spongebob is a sea creature, sea creatures normally eat with tartar sauce, and I love tartar sauce myself. I'm probably going to like play more of this, but on a, on a separate save file. Uh, just so I can like, play more of it. Or who knows, I might just keep it blind for the sake of being blind. I'm not actually blind, so... Uh... I saved it! <laughs> I saved myself! As you can see, Spongebob does not have... Um, cannot cause the stun. Fresh like a spring breeze. There are definitely some sound effects missing. There's something that they need to kind of like patch out. Because it is a little bit um, annoying, to say the least. Can I jump over there? Yes, I can. Right, who is it? Uh, SpongeBob can jump off the walls, so he's got a wall jump ability. Into a show. Ba -ba -dum. Oh. I suspect there is something over there. Or did I just check? I just probably checked that, didn't I? Ah, boy. I am not paying attention. Right, we we should almost be at the top. Yeah, King Jellyfish is, uh, should be at the next part. So we should be at the top of Spark, Mount, Spark Mountain. Be able to get the King Jellyfish Jelly. He's actually not bad of a boss. Bubble buddy. Gosh, everyone is trying to help out today. Step quietly there. That king jellyfish is just up at the top of this path. Good luck. You'll need it. Thanks, Bubble Buddy. I feel like a new spot. Can't go wrong with Bubble Buddy. Oh, 
I knew the King Jellyfish was big, but who knew he had such a beautiful voice? <laughs> <laughs> I like how he sings the theme. I don't remember him getting all electrified, of course, in the original. So that's pretty cool. And he's sh shitting out other jellyfish. Very, very, very easy, boss. The only three health. Uh, some of the other ones, of course, have more health. Wow, I am not timing that properly. I feel like a new sponge. I think he brings out, yep, the blue ones. I keep forgetting that they had some sort of shockwave attack. I can't remember if they did in the original. Whoa, that was quick! There we go. I just like that. As if that was just a regular meeting. Not only that, but the fact that the jellyfish jelly is in a bottle just behind the curtain. Like, as, as fans of the show will know, SpongeBob always milks them like fucking cows. But <laughs> the fact that he's got it in a jar is a fact. Yeah, I'm selling my own uh, milk. That's like getting beef stars when you had a chicken who was selling her own eggs, which is. Quite disturbing, to say the least. I don't know how you're supposed to get those ones. There is an alternate route to get something. I can't remember where, though. And I got that first try, thank god. <laughs> it normally takes me forever to get that. Um Ah yes, I knew Larry was here. See, no problem. You could do anything you set your mind and your muscle to. Was that literally for that for that spatula? <laughs> oh boy. Right, let's go to the exit. Oh, yeah. Oh, that feels so much better. Anything for my best friend Squidward. Can I rub some on? Um, what if I just gave you this? <laughs> oh, this is... Oh, I'm really looking forward to doing the rest of this. But next is downtown. Yep, next we've got downtown, and then after that we've got Goon Lagoon, which we can already go to as well, and then we need five more to unlock the first proper boss. But we are going to go um, to downtown, uh, I was about to say downtown Springfield, downtown Bikini Bottom, which is already unlocked now. Uh, but with that being said, we'll end this episode off here. So, with that being said, I've been Game Breaker Mills, this has been Spongebob Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated, and I'll catch you all next time. See you later!